Okay, this is Caliber Zero today, here today, and I'm going to show you how to build kind of a magic bridge and mine test using the Messicons mod. Now, first, let me show you um, a bri nice bridge I've created. Now, as you can see here, I've put um, some torches up so you can kind of see um, like kind of where the bridge is. You can see that there is nothing here currently. Um, this is kind of like the default state of the magic bridge where it doesn't have the bridge there, but then when you place um, a power plant, it um, appears magically. No, not magically, but the messy cons. So once you place it on a specified area, it appears, and you can walk across it. Now, um, this uses um, ghost stone, uh, not to be confused with move stone. And um, you probably know Ghost Stone is um, when it has power to it, it disappears like it is now. Um, so, for example, I have some here. So, if I put um, some power source next to it, it turns them on and they um, disappear. Now, um, to make the bridge so that way, whenever you don't have it powered, it disappears. And then, when you do add power to it, it appears. I use a knot gate which takes the input and negates it. So as you can see here, um, this is a negative input where there's no power, then it creates power like it is now. However, if um, you add positive input into it, it um, doesn't send out a signal. So in effect, when there is no, no um, like thing placed, then it, um, nothing appears. But when you do place something, then the blocks appear. So it's the same principle with this bridge here. Um, let me just show you. Um, there's just a simple knot circuit in here. Um, to get this kind of setup going, I just had um, just any kind of platform block here to make it look interesting. Then I had um, Messi going on the side because um, you can't place it on the top because the power plant only conduct, conducts um, Mesicon electricity to the sides and not the bottom. So if you place a block like that, so then the person places block on there, conducts to the side to the block there, goes down through blocks here, and goes up through here, and comes down here, and there's a line connecting it to a knot um, gate. Then it goes up to here and to a um, ghost block, which then connects to the bridge. So then, um, when you don't have anything there, it notices that there is no input and negates that into positive input and turns the bridge off. Um, but when you add positive input, it takes that and, sorry about that, takes that and negates it into negative input and tells it the bridge to appear. And that's pretty much it. You can do that um, for really any type of thing you can want. You can modify that in any way, really. Um, just simple knot gate and then ghost blocks. So you can really do that for anything. Um, then keep in mind that this just shows uh, negate. Um, a negation of such things. For example, um, you can just use positive input instead so that way when you um, do have power it turns off, as you can see here. And that's pretty much it. Um, the many um, messy cons type machines, you can take this concept and use it in a whole bunch of different ways, not just through bridges or making things disappear. Um, this is just kind of a neat way that you can have, um, like if you want, it, want some type of adventure map where you have the player place um, a power plant down to make a bridge appear, then you can use this idea. Um, really any type of similar thing you can use it as well. And that's pretty much it. Oh, um, this is Excalibur Zero, signing off.